Yo, what's up? This is uh, PR's news uh, headline. Uh, just uh, raw footage. So, take one. Now, um, currently, what's trending right now? We look at uh, according to um, the, the Aussie dollar, it's kind of sloping down to 60 cents. Now, what we have in future prophecy will probably bring down to 50 cents to. Um, uh, sorry. What? Uh, let me double check. <laughs> so, what we see here is um, one Australian dollar is 61 uh, American cents. So, what we see in the future is going to go down to 50 cents. That means um, that the the American uh, dollar is very strong, and our dollar is very weak. Now, what what is going on here? Australia is free of debt. Now, if Australia is free of debt, shouldn't the money go up? How does it work? It doesn't work that way though. How it works here? It should be about on par. But it's not on par. I, I, I'm not, I don't know what I'm saying. The, the true matter, in fact, that it was kept at 66 cents for a long time. The signal theory was it was hacked by Africans in Africa. And the one that ordered it was Libya, Morocco, Sudan, and also South Africa had to join in. Therefore, Australia and the Ditcher and became Americans. So, there you go. You got three countries. And then the, the, the third one was Ismaili. If the Ismaili were the ones in Russia that were trying to boycott the, the Africans, but because they boycotted, they smashed them too. So, uh, uh, Russia had no choice but to bring down the Aussie dollar. So, there you go. Thank you for listening. And this is the speech. Now, uh, how do we this economy it's like it's all about economy what we see clearly we have a lot of economy what we see clearly a lot of nations I think around the world going on the internet one two three four five major nations around the world that are debt free three are in the Middle East one is uh, somewhere uh, in Asia because it's be uh, somewhere and uh, the island is debt free. Another is debt free. It's called uh, the UK. UK is debt free. So if UK is debt free. I mean, I'm not saying United Kingdom, I'm saying UK. Ukraine is debt free. No, it's true. So, five nations are debt free. Go figure. Australia, what what I found on I'm not sure it's real Wikipedia or I mean Wiki, what Wiki says that we had no debt, but we still had debt. Let me let me see the scoreboard of all Australian debt. Five point four to five going to five point seven trillion US dollars. So we have a lot of debt to a lot of the nations are like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine specific countries that were mentioned. Now one, two, three, they didn't like it. So if they didn't like it, they they, they didn't know. So five point seven or five point four went to five point seven trillion US dollars. That's a figure count. What about America? How much debt they really have? Thirty three point five seven thirty three point five seven is that what we've got? It's way beyond uh, a trillion. Thirty three Five seven one trillion 
US dollars is American no it's not 33 trillion it's, it's actually it's, it's above it it's way too high they have so much interest to China we know it's China we know it's Australia the Australia for some reason have to pay uh, goes to somewhere and, and, and another country that owns Canada I think uh, got Scotland and got back in the olden days go back in the olden days so forget about it <laughs> that's why I say America can never pay back the debt you can pay five trillion away somewhere and put ten trillion so somewhere they will never pay back the debt they are a big debt country okay now now that, that's it's clear states um, it's not found here it's not found there you won't be able to find it in school books now let's see what UK says well UK is actually uh, United Kingdom is I believe uh, uh, one nation's offer I think the other nation I haven't been following news from there but um, let's see from England big four they know about the big four it was three to four now <laughs> it was three got to big four four point nine right yeah four point nine interest but then it's like four point one that's three point nine four nine <laughs> so let, let, let's see what's going on here three going to four Four point one, four point oh one billion UK pounds. <laughs> so US dollars, UK pounds. Uh, I'm just saying whatever. Don't worry. Now uh, uh, I'm gonna this this uh this recording is um being hacked by a bot. So we're, we're not allowing this to be uh, exposed. But um, let, let's see what, what, what it says here. See? So, and this is, this, this is believed to be known as Tourette. I'm having trouble in, in seeing what I'm trying to say. 5.11. One, one. 5.11. One, one, uh, hundred trillion dollars uh, and that 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 is not that is not dollars that UK pound so there you go now according to this um thing um biggest debt country the states something else is to be believed to be Saudi Arabia's real the Saudi Arabia we, we see here um, okay that didn't work they use something else so Saudi Arabia real is believed to um, It actually goes to um, South America's um, East Bank. So the bank in South America is actually higher when it comes to um, debt. So I don't want to talk about it. So um, let's see. Saudi Arabia has a big debt. And I don't think they'll be able to pay it. So th th that is it. So. Um, um, regarding with um, Australian dollar, yeah, what was it? so the 
pretty though. No, uh, uh, all are dead. So, but it does not make sense <laughs> according to what I believe. Um, um, so, if one Australian dollar is actually uh, sixty-one. If we've got equivalent right now is one dollar Australian is actually seventy eight US cents. But on the market we see here, uh, if you can see it cl clearly, um, it states it's um sixty one. In global market it will be seventy eight. And if you go to the shops it'll be seventy six. That's the current market. So, um, our dollar, the AUD dollar, is hacked, it's been scandalized by African, uh, as a state of three countries, I think they've uh, come to total four countries. One was believed to be uh, some foreign mafia in Taiwan. So, um, he, he wanted to bring down the plot of an Aussie dollar to bring up the uh, Chinese uh, yuan. But then the problem is that it went to the American dollar. So um, there you go. And if if China goes up, inflation goes down for, for Australia. Ooh. That's how it works. Um, and that's how, that's, how, that's, that's, that's what's been happening in technology, you know. I go to the shops and stuff and it's been inflation going down. So uh, China go up, inflation go down. Australia. In America, if China goes up, wages will increase. That's what it's been saying. Wages does increase. Um, in Australia, wages, for some reason, is stagnated and it would have increased by like maybe one cent. So it didn't really make a difference. Um, what's the point? <laughs> what's the point? And then oh, I'm not saying one international cent, I'm told. We were like three dollars. Three dollars per hour. In, in Australia and the Centrelink problem is hacked to the point where you cannot change the the, 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 the money thing so if people want to find out what's going on with Centrelink it has to do with my world or someone else's world being trampled over now the ones that know about it are the AFP and that's probably it <laughs> you know uh, it lies on with uh, America's uh, top officials so um, we don't know what's going on. They're trying to fix it. I managed to pull a string um, for DSP and for carers, you know. Thank God for me. But um, and, and the God that was in me, and the gods that were in me, and the gods that were around me, and the gods that were through me, and everything. everything. So and the people that tried to help at times, um, but it did not affect the new start. So I can't really do anything. Regarding with that, I think there will be a better solution in the future. So, um, thank you for listening for Pia's new speech. And where am I? I'm just somewhere doing a new speech. Thank you for listening, and thank you for um, the one that um, brought this microphone to pass. Thank you very much. Uh, comes with a thing you can um, put your phone here and then, you know, read from it. So, thank you very much, and. Um, yeah, so then where's I missing uh, 30 cents or 20 cents? Uh, or oh, 30 cents, I'd say. Um, I have no idea, but the missing 30 cents, 28 cents, or 29 cents, or 27 cents, roughly around there, is actually. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, it's only 17 cents. It's actually close to 16 cents. 16 cents international market is actually gone. So it's been wiped out for some reason. And that's because, as I said, it was African, Libya, the start of the war. Now, the, 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 the reason why Libya started the war is because of Taiwan. Now, when Taiwan hacked it, the Libya, and these guys joined in. And these guys are known as, uh, not foreign trade markets, known as a Kotic uh, ISIL affiliated. So ISO is, is just wonderland word to say. But I'm I'm gonna clarify ISO still exists to this day. And they're infiltrating our network, our internet, 
to make it stagnated until I make a decision or until someone makes a decision to bring down the internet money. You know, the money, it's way too expensive. It's been over 10 years and we still have the same economy thing when when really other places are getting cheaper, you know. Or they get cheaper until the price, then it's like nothing's happening, you know. And no one knows what's going on in this world. Are we living in a real world or a fake world? I have no idea. But anyways, thank you very much and uh, thank you very much and see you next time. Bye. Anyways, um, I'm not going to be um, doing hooky spooky stuff. <laughs> My, my bad. <laughs> now, um, um, uh, I believe, um, also few people are actually guilty. And they, they, they have a neighbor that's guilty, another neighbor that's guilty, another neighbor that's part not guilty, because it wasn't his fault. They're the ones that have been, um, hacking, uh, the, the bio, bio something of internet. For a long time, but they don't say a word. They don't. They don't want to be paid by the judge. I want. I want name. So that's the two I can think of. And then you get your others are close by. Your others are close by. So in Australia alone, if I was to get this map and see who's actually guilty in hacking the um, system, got Centrelink and stuff, you'd be surprised. Hundred and six to hundred and seven found totally in the national database, that, um, in Australia. But to be specific, I think we have over fifty people in Australia, individuals known as marketeers. Are not really marketeers. They're policemen, but they're not police. They have no credentials. The SWAT team, they say, but they're not. The raidsmen. <laughs> They raid the uh, uh, Australia economy. They raid everything. And, uh, another word of them, they think they're skimmers. They're not skimmers. They're skinners. Another word's called S C I N. Skin. So what happens is, you have your five thousand dollar in your wallet. Not wallet. Your your digital wallet. You use it. Nothing comes out, and next you know you get depleted to zero dollars. What happened? The skinners was involved to hack it. So I believe they were from New South Wales or they're from Queensland. So if you're from New South Wales and New South Wales are from Queensland and they're doing it from there. But firstly believed to be Europe or South Africa or even USA. But sometimes it's possibly from another country too. It can be USA. So um, they're known as people of a Vietnamese descent, Chinese descent, Korean descent, Thai descent and Lao descent. Cambodians already do it, but sometimes they involve in a combat and we use Cambodian. So, and then you got these uh, Turkish descent, you got these ISO descent, and then Lebanese used to do it, but don't do it because it's stupid. Or someone do it back to you and you lose all your house. People have been kicked out because their accounts have been skinned. There was no way. So, um, a lot of people believe it was African because they see the other news, and some Africans don't do it. But at the time, they, they they didn't do much. They, they actually take real money and then screw you over. All right, that's what we learn from the news. But the problem is that these are the people that, um, that I dealt with from day to day basis. So there you go. From a Chinese man, Chinese ABC man. So um, uh, anyways, um, Now, since the news is out there, uh, what whatever news I have um, from here, uh, I believe um, I, I'm not gonna state much. But I already talked about Taiwan. It was just a mafia guy, you know, or the, the gangster guy or something, who's doing a bit of hack. Now they can't fix it. They want to fix it again. 
But the problem is that they scared they would go up to 78. At that time it was, they fixed it at the time, but it was going to 70. And then it was going to 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, it was going too strong. And they said, no, we don't like it. We don't like it. So we're going to bring it down, down, down. So really it should be 78. But you go to the shop, it'll be 76. You know, international rates are different compared to when you go to the shops. So, um, but some shops it's higher. Some shops you actually see 74. Uh, one Australian dollar is 74 cents, but other shops it's like it plays safely with the news. So I have no idea what's going on. <laughs> Go figure. But then, um, you know. Um, anyways, from, uh, uh, I can't really explain much. Um, but uh, I've been skimmed, not skimmed, skinned. S C I N. So S C I N N E D. So skinned, or S C I N D skin before so I've been skinned many times you know I'm sick and tired you know to the point you go back to the bank they have to pay your money back and you have to withdraw straight away so this is what you do okay I have a um, uh, just say I have an account I have a uh, uh, just a everyday account now everyday account there's no interest and there's, there's no interest and there's interest in uh, glued into your card this is what you do you create a saving account with the same bank and you gotta use internet banking right and then you transfer all your money into that that saving account it will not be touched and do not link that that saving account into the card or into another card because that is biggest mistake the internet is found in the chip it's called paywave paywave or this not, not, not even the, the chip itself you right but they say it's a pay wave, it's a problem. So you get skinned, you, you lose tens of thousands of dollars, and you have to use internet banking. Back to internet banking. It, but a lot of people don't want to use it. But it doesn't affect everyone, it only affects specific people, you know. So, um, so, so that, that's what I can recommend, yeah. Um, people already know that a long time ago, you know. They put it all away and and just you know, um, another thing is um, when your bills come in from your banking, just say look, don't charge me every month. Uh, give me a message and I'll pay it myself. You know, I pay myself. You know, so don't charge every month. So it's like okay, we be paying, right? And then uh, take snapshots and uh, print statements and take snapshot print print it out out of your printer. Have an e printer or something and print out into your computers, into your space, and everything. Copy everything, you know. Um, and at the time, um, whatever money you lose, take it to the bank and they'll pay it back. There you go. There you go. See? I got money paid back once. I can't, I can't be bothered doing this. <laughs> it was five. Anyway. So, um, uh, so there you go. Uh, what about linking it to, like, say, say overseas bank? Uh, if you link to overseas bank, and you have a card that too can be skinned. Oh. So don't link it to a card, right? If draw in to your card, but uh, into your account, not into your card. Okay. Um, found that has better um, security um, if you have a credit card the two can be skinned you know they, they've tried many factors and stuff we've tried material to everything but I found out the best material is called white silver when it comes to platinum or whatever but all oh, they try to get rid of it you know it's not pay away you know? I don't know they're trying other things you know so um, white silver or, or even I call it white fang White thing, white thing, F A N G, material for the um, the chip. But then you don't need the chip. I don't know. So there you go. So get an email, get a message. You don't get emails, just demand it. You know? <laughs> um. So what about internet? That can be skinned. Oh, that's always skinned all the time. Skinned. S S C I N D. Skinned. mean scam something something network 
So skin. Alright. It's iron to what is it? Uh S C R N as well. Skin. That's what I call it. Mm. So thank you very much uh for listening and uh currently it's gonna be um uh I'll be, be putting it as soon as it's going on. Um uh I believe uh There's an error with with uh, five point one one whatever whatever it was. I believe currently right now the market in is it debt has rose, but debt has fallen in United Kingdom. Which how many countries is that? You know. <laughs> so debt rose, debt has fallen. We know all around the world um, debt has fallen. To a specific amount of degree, okay. However, this is a line choice. Stay protected. Keep on hoping. And keep on uh, knowing the edges that that, that that make you. That some will try to bring you down, but try to be at least one step or two step ahead before it happens okay so that's, that's what I can say quick tips for today is currently 26 uh, minutes and 40 seconds and thank you very much and say and um, goodbye so um, <laughs> I don't know what I mean uh, what I mean uh, I'm going to do that sign Thank you very much. Bye.